Master Your English Collocations, A Journey of Self-Assessment and Feedback. Hello, English language enthusiasts. Welcome to another episode in our series on advanced vocabulary focusing on collocations. In today's episode, we'll explore a crucial aspect of language learning, self-assessment and feedback. Specifically, We'll guide you on how to monitor your progress in collocation usage. Let's jump right in. First off, let's understand why monitoring progress is essential. Just like in any learning process, checking your progress helps you identify your strengths, your weaknesses, and areas where you can improve. In the case of collocations, Monitoring is the key to avoiding common mistakes and becoming more proficient with the English language. Next, we'll explore self-assessment. This is where you personally review your use of collocations. To make this easier, try to write more in English, perhaps a daily journal or blog. As you write, be conscious of your collocation usage. After writing, Go back and review what you've written. Can you spot any mistakes or awkward phrasing? Are there collocations that you tend to overuse? After self-assessment, feedback is the next step. If you're learning alone, consider using online language tools to check your work. If you're in a classroom setting or a study group, have your peers or your instructor review your writing. This external feedback provides a fresh perspective, allowing you to catch mistakes that you might have overlooked. Lastly, let's cover some strategies for ongoing monitoring. Keeping a collocation diary can be a great help. Jot down new collocations as you come across them and review this diary periodically. Try to use the new collocations in your writing or conversations. Over time, you'll naturally become more comfortable with them. Also, set specific goals for yourself. For example, you might aim to learn 10 new collocations each week. This gives you a concrete target to work towards. And there we have it. Self-assessment and feedback are powerful tools to improve your English collocation usage. Monitoring your progress helps you identify common mistakes and continuously improve. Remember, mastering collocations is a journey, not a race. So, keep practicing, stay patient, and you'll gradually see improvement. We hope this video has been helpful. As always, don't hesitate to share your thoughts, questions, or your own strategies in the comments below. Until our next English language adventure, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep making progress.